sky is in cold rain, trench coats and turtlenecks. Hot tea and tongue pines for what? For what? Blue skies, blue lawns, swimming pools and track homes with smiling people living quick lives and getting paid for it. The Eisenhower dream has become the American nightmare. I am among the walking dead. What have I done? I think it's happening. It's for real. I'm gonna die today. Fuck! Such an anticlimactic death. Spend the last hours of my life in jail. Fuck that. Are you still there? I had some trouble. I had a bit of delay. Here? Be there as soon as possible. Most people work eight hour days. But what if they knew that's all they had left? Eight hours. I'm hungry, I'm tired, I'm thirsty. I need a fucking pint.
ready, or do you need more time? More time, please. No problem. I'll just be right back. Wait. Jeff Guinness. On tap. I'll have a pint. Sure. Say. So, are you ready? I'm just having difficulty with an unexpected change, you know? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck to order. Okay, well, the Caesar salad's really good. Does it come with bread? <laughs> yeah, it comes with bread. Sounds like a good choice to me. can't leave. We have the Rockwell meeting in 30 minutes. Mr. Langley, you want to find the Simpson portfolio? You look for it. My brother Neil is in trouble and he needs me, and I don't intend on wasting my time with an arrogant ass like yourself. Now excuse me. Can I get a Guinness? You almost out of here? <laughs> yep, about half hour. So what's his story? I don't know, but I think he's kind of cute. Yeah, if you like that desperate psycho thing he's got going on. Who knows, maybe he's married. But hopefully his wife left him. Oh, you're sick. <laughs> well, he drinks Guinness. He can't be that bad. All right, this one's on the house. <laughs> so what's your story? Do you like working there? I don't know, it's a living. What do you do? It doesn't matter. This is the best bloody salad I've ever eaten, sirs. <laughs> I know. Let's speak hypothetically, are you game? Sure. If you would have found out this morning, that you had only eight hours left to live, would you have come to work? Hmm, gee, let me think. Hell no. What if I told you I was? Told me you were what? Gonna drop dead by 6 p.m. <laughs> Are you serious? Well, <clears throat> I might say something like, meet me out back in 30 minutes. Hypothetically speaking, of course. Of course.